What we're going to do here today is perform a seafoam treatment to a Hyundai Accent 2012 model. What we'll proceed to do is make sure when you do purchase a um, seafoam product that the seal cap is on it. This way you make sure that there is no contaminants and that it has not been altered. If you're not ready to use, just put the cap on it since it's, um, it's very flammable and it evaporates very easily. What we want, what we want to do here is disconnect the hose that connects to the CCP valve in order to get the intake um, air that goes into the lifters and the valves and pistons uh, of the engine. Once you've disconnected the uh, hose from the TCP valve, in this case with the Hyundai Accent, you notice that there are two hoses. I disconnect the one that goes straight to the uh, intake for the chambers, combustion chambers. Notice how the throttle of the engine hesitates when I uh, cover the hose. That tells you that you have the right one. So what we'll perform to do is provide one third of this product, seafoam, into the intake um, airflow system of the engine of a um, Hyundai Accent 2012. What we'll do in this case is take the uh, a straw that has a um, flexible edge on it, put it on the uh, on the intake. It's a little tricky. You have to play with it. So you make sure that um, what what happens here is that you don't lose throttle on the engine while performing it. Okay. So what we'll do now is that done with. We'll proceed to place the hose back into the TCP valve. Hose back into the TCP valve. Can I kick? There you go. Keep going. Put the hose back on, and we're done. Okay. Done. I got that one. Come on. Now we'll take the second third of the uh, seafoam product and pour it into the oil pan. one third into the oil of the engine 
And the last but not least, we'll go right into the gas tank with the gasoline. Feels a little heavy. That'll do it. Now, what proceeds on, in this in this uh, in this process is to let the engine sit for at least five to ten minutes, so seafoam can do its um, magic through the air intake and oil. Seafoam remaining goes right into the gas tank. I would strongly recommend that you use a funnel since there is a little spring door into the gas tank that needs to stay open while pouring the seafoam product into the gas tank. There you go. And this is a wrap. Now to process the results of Seafoam product on a Hyundai Accent 2012 with 8,000 miles. Well, now the truth comes in the exhaust system. The muffler will provide us evidence of what kind of maintenance this vehicle has received for the last 8,000 miles.